Between 1968 and 1972, humanity achieved the unthinkable, traveling to the moon. But few people know every Apollo mission, why the program ended, and when we're going back. It all started with the Saturn V, the most powerful rocket ever built. A true giant capable of sending astronauts nearly 400,000 kilometers away. Apollo 7 was the first crewed mission, a crucial test in Earth orbit. Apollo 8 changed everything, the first humans to orbit the moon. The iconic Earthrise photo came from this mission. Apollo 9 tested the lunar module near Earth. Apollo 10 rehearsed the entire landing profile, stopping just kilometers above the surface. Then came Apollo 11. In 1969, Neil Armstrong and Buzz Aldrin left humanity's first footprints on the moon. Apollo 12 perfected the landing. Apollo 13 suffered a life-threatening explosion, but returned safely in a legendary mission. Apollo 14, 15, 16, and 17 expanded exploration, long walks, geology experiments, and the iconic lunar rover. Apollo 17 in 1972 was the last time humans walked on the lunar surface. Why do we stop? Mostly cost. And the evidence that we went is overwhelming. Retroreflectors still used with lasers, lunar rocks, and independent tracking by the Soviet Union. Now we're going back. With the Artemis program, Artemis II will orbit the moon and Artemis III will land astronauts once again. It will include the first woman and the first person of color to step on the moon. The moon is only the beginning. Subscribe for more journeys across the universe.